Thank you very much. I felt it. I hope everybody felt it. Uh, Madhu just in her own way wanted to express that she's happy on this tour. And 15, 20 minutes walking distance from the square, the main meeting place, the center, so depending on the place you take. Zagreb with its uh, mainly Austro-Hungarian architecture, Habsburgs, although tomorrow taking you also to the upper town and from our guide, who's gonna come at 9 o'clock to meet us in the hotel on the bus, you are gonna learn even more. So, town with the blue buses, with blue trams as well, so the color is blue, <laughs> not like white for split. We are even proud to make some of the, these trams you're gonna see here in Zagreb, not only in Spain and elsewhere tomorrow. Otherwise, feel safe. This is, uh, despite the graffitis that you're gonna see, if not today already, then tomorrow, safe city, we don't have any gangs. These graffitis are not uh, connected to gangs. But some, I would say, teenagers who lack imagination because they tend to repeat some words over and over again. if you would like to have them already today if you want And yeah, the first challenge there is still not sending us at the back of the road because there is for us not to come at 2 a.m. My second highlight was you coming back from Ibiza 1, seeing you all coming up that road. And my third highlight, and
Don't open it. Don't open it. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Zagreb, my hometown, Croatia, my country. We salute you with our traditional instruments called tamburica, and we'll play one more traditional song for you. And I hope that you will enjoy this dinner and this evening, and later we have some surprises for you, so please enjoy. And once more, welcome.
and they do that together. And one night, just like this, uh, this young boy got the opportunity to walk her home from the place they had rehearsals to her home. And he was trembling, you know, he was shaking to the side because he needed to tell her how much he cares about her, how much he truly loves her. And somehow he did it. He managed to do and say her what he feels about her. And she was just like now, nothing. <laughs> she was just standing and looking to him, you know. And just when they uh, came in front of her family home, he tried to kiss her. Yeah, she said uh, no, sorry, <laughs> sorry. So bad luck. And after he found out that she was with another boy, having something mingling around, so not so good for him. However, he stopped all communication with her in that moment. He stopped texting messages to her, <laughs> you know, stopped uh, dancing with her, stopped touching at her and pulled her. And then something happened, strange, but after three months, she contacted him. Also by Nokia 3310, <laughs> the old ten years ago. So she asked him, why aren't you texting with me anymore? Why aren't you dancing with me? Why aren't you looking? I miss your gaze, you know. He said, well, I think that I did my very best, and this chapter for me, it's over. On that, as the women had things, as I think, she said, okay, chapter it is, but the book isn't finished, until I say so. So now she set up rendezvous with him. Next is that their love was so bright, shine, and tremendous, they were becoming somebody in this world. And however, that kind of love has the other side of the story. And the other side is that everybody around them that they connect wanted peace of them, wanted peace of their brightness, peace of their life. And what happened next is that he started forgetting about her after years of their relationship. And, of course, she started to feel jealousy about it. <laughs> and then, as on, like on the beginning of the story, just like this, something snapped. And they got separated. Oh. However, this young fellow of mine got the courage once more, took the Tamburitsa players, and they walked him from his home to her home. And playing music, that hasn't happened in here like for a century or so. <laughs> and everybody was on their balconies, it's eastern part of the Zagreb where this happened. And they came uh, in front of her home, in front of her window, and they played two songs that bring them actually together. And in that moment, he asked her to marry him. Unfortunately, it was too late. <laughs> yeah, her heart didn't listen anymore to his songs or to his words. 
However, they still continue to dance together. <laughs> contact him back again and said to him that she made the most biggest mistake in her life and that she wants him back so because of this bright love they had he tried again actually they tried together two swords however the rabbit hole goes deep inside oh, yeah and as he told me one night he got up all shaking and he was sweaty, you know, the feeling wasn't right. So next day he invited her to park, biggest park in Zagreb, a really beautiful place. And they weren't saying a word. She noticed by just by looking in his eyes something was wrong. The phrase that she told him I will remember all my life, and it's a phrase or metaphor, she said to him, I love you when you are there and you love me when I'm not here. And it was hard for her and for him because honestly they were true first lovers, best friends and mutual teachers. However, he gave her one last hug and never saw her again.
Svira i moju! for another guy. <laughs> so good for her. And this young fella of mine wishes to her all the best in this world, all the luck that she can get. And for him, he got, uh, you know, faithful to his dances, to his tradition, to music, so that you, good people, could bring back to your home only the most beautiful memories here from my country, from my town. And when you come home, when you see your beloved ones, your friends, your family, tell them about monuments you saw here. Tell them about food you tasted, if you liked it. Tell them about the music you heard and about this true love story that happened here. And do not forget the most important thing, thing of all. Why are we doing this? And the message of this show. When you come back home with plane to America, Australia, Canada, Tell your beloved ones how much you love them and don't ever let them go. Okay, it's a bad night for you. 